There's debate in the scientific community whether there are two species of African elephants or just one. In this episode, we'll refer to two separate species of African elephants, the savanna elephant and the newly classified forest elephant. Forest elephants are smaller than savanna elephants. Savanna elephants, who stand as the largest living land animals, weigh between 4,400 and 13,450 pounds, and stand 7 to 13 feet at shoulder height, with males coming in larger than females. Forest elephants average about 6,200 pounds, and 5 feet at shoulder height. Forest elephants have four toes on their front feet and three on their back feet, while savanna elephants have five on their front and four on their back. The tusks of forest elephants are better adapted for their life in dense forests, and are thus straighter and thinner than the savanna elephants' swooping tusks. Forest elephants also have rounder ears than their savanna counterparts. However, both species flap their large ears to keep cool in the hot African sun. As their name suggests, African elephants live in Africa. Their populations are mostly fragmented, and they no longer inhabit some of their historic range. Savanna elephants find home in savannas, deserts, beaches, scrub forests, and woodlands, while forest elephants are generally restricted to forested areas, including rainforests and swamps. African elephants take mud and dust baths to help keep themselves cool and to protect their skin from sunburn. These large mammals have specialized noses, called a trunk, through which they can breathe like a snorkel or hold water for drinking. African elephants have two finger-like projections on the ends of their trunks, which help them grab objects as well as food. African elephants are herbivores and eat fruits, grasses, barks, and twigs, which they'll consume continuously throughout the day. African elephants don't sleep much because they need to spend so much time eating. Like beavers, these animals are considered ecosystem engineers. They have a large influence over their environments. Elephants dig in riverbeds during dry spells, which creates water holes for animals all around. They also knock over trees, which helps keep the savanna from converting into woodlands. These elephants also disperse seeds via their dung. This also creates excellent dung beetle habitat. Predators to elephants include lions, hyenas, wild dogs, and crocodiles. Typically, predators only take young or sickly individuals because adult elephants would be too much trouble. Both male and female African elephants have tusks. For breeding purposes, during parts of the year, the males, called bulls, enter an aggressive state. Throughout this time, they may rub against trees, dribble urine, and make loud calls. African elephants breed year-round, and males can tell when females are ready to mate due to a change in the smell of their urine. The male will pat the female with his trunk and she may run away. He'll chase her and eventually they'll both rub each other and then mate. The female may mate with multiple males during this time. Like sperm whales, elephants form matriarchal, or female-led, groups. The males live on their own or in small, loose groups. When a female is ready to give birth, she'll leave her clan for a time before returning with her newborn. Elephants may gestate up to 22 months, but their gestation may be shorter if environmental conditions are optimal. The group will help raise and protect the calf, which will be completely dependent on its mother's milk for its first four months of life. After this, it may still nurse occasionally for at least three years, and won't become fully independent until eight years of age. Female elephants, called cows, reach reproductive maturity earlier than males, at around 12 years of age. They'll typically give birth to around four calves throughout their lives, with two to nine years between births. Males reach reproductive maturity around 20 years of age, and usually have larger males to contend with before they can mate with females. In the wild, African elephants may reach up to 70 years of age. They're known to mourn their dead, with members of a group having been observed returning to the bones of a deceased matriarch. African elephants are also known to have excellent memories, which makes sense considering they need to remember all the members of their group, which can reach upwards of 70 members, as well as where the best watering holes are. There are, of course, other elephants too, called Asian elephants, but we've talked about them in a previous episode which we encourage you to check out. 
For more facts on African elephants, check out the links in the description. Thank you to Jathan, Dan, Slapstick Genius, Cabrera, and Zyndine for today's request. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today, and thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.